trim this thing up so it looks really nice. It's touching the house, so we got to keep it cut back. At this point in its life, it's going to keep touching the house because it's so big. Um, and then you can see the retaining wall is cracked in several areas on the front here where it's starting to separate, starting to pull apart. I tried to use some caulking to seal that gap. It's not really right. You can see this corner down here is settled too. It's either settled or they purposely built it a little bit lower for water to travel off that side. But this is where our plumbing cleanouts are likely located at. I have no idea where they are because they've been buried under the turf or something like that. And it's too windy out today for me to hop up on the roof and use a plumbing vent for the sewer camera. So we're going to come back in another day and do that. You can see the wind pushing that tree into the house. It's going to cause damage sooner than later.